Hi guys, so I'm back from Kuala Lumpur now and I'm gonna film my beauty haul today. So I mostly got Korean and Japanese skincare items um, with a few makeup bits thrown in so I'm gonna get right into it. I think I'll start with Daiso. So I went to the Daiso in the Polyvian Mall and everything was five ringgits each which is about like one pound. So it's really, really cheap and I was so excited. So I'm just going to pull everything out and I'll show you. So let me just pull everything out so you don't hear that crinkling noise. Hold on. Okay, so the first thing I got are some of these facial scrubbers. I already have some of these, but I just always like to get more because I use them every single day. And these are going to be my new ones to use. They're really cute and they're really cheap. Everything is five ring it as I said so this is just like a nice purple one this is a pink the next thing is this elegant honey rose jewelry lip and I think it's sort of like a pigmented sort of lip gloss and it's in this really cute packaging um, the color is elegant honey and yeah it's just really cute I like the color so that's that I got some um, face, what are these called? Like cotton, oh my god, I can't talk. Cotton pads, I <laughs> can't think. And it's just the ones that I like. I've not tried these yet, but it's these type. I really like these type because they don't break apart. Um, so I got a few boxes of these high quality puffs, they're called, and there's 60 pieces in each just chucking things on my bed um next is this eyebrow pencil in the color brown and it has like this sort of angled um tip like i think it's the shoot umura one has that as well so i really wanted to try it and yeah this is the only color they actually had but my eyebrows are brown anyway so that's brow pencil i got this silk hair band it's called in pink and um, it looks like this is just like you know when you want to wash your face to keep your hair out of your face and it says big size and stop closely okay <laughs> whatever that means this is some blackhead um strips there's four in here and i really love charcoal um you know strips because they're black obviously so you can see the gunk that comes out better and i really like that so um decided to try these i got this bath um sort of scrub thing it's a towel they call it two-tone nylon towel and it's basically like really really good for exfoliating your skin it's not a washcloth it's much harsher than a washcloth and you really feel clean after you use this sort of thing um my boyfriend uses this a lot um this sort of thing as well nigerian people use this sort of thing and japanese people i think other asians as well but it's basically like really really harsh <laughs> but it feels really good you just feel so clean compared to using like a loofah or um a regular washcloth so i got this one and i thought the color was cute got some lashes these are just like kind of demi lashes um if you can see and i just thought i would try these i don't think these come with glue though but yeah and the lash band is transparent so i thought that would be cool i have trouble applying lashes so i decided to go for like ones that aren't completely full i think i, I have much better luck when i can just put them on the end so i got this because of man woman film what is her new youtube channel i can't remember but i saw her use this a long time ago with some soap and it's this firming net so you use it with like your cleanser or soap and it makes like you can see the picture there it makes it like this and i don't know why i need this but it's just really cute and so it also comes with a little case it says can hold a mini tube too you can take it anywhere <laughs> i got some hand and nail cream this is in the strawberry scent this is just so japanesey i love this packaging and it's very light it's a nice hand cream actually very lightweight and 
it doesn't feel gross on your hands after you use it you know how like some lotions you get that sort of weird after feel you don't get that with this so i like it it's not amazing but it's decent i got this nail polish in the color candy it's the fancy bloom nail color and that's how it looks it's just a really pretty pink i know i just tipped out all my q-tips into this bag but I bought Q-tips. I thought this packaging was cute. I, I really needed Q-tips. I was in Kuala Lumpur for two weeks and I forgot Q-tips. So I got these from Daiso. And they're all in the Daiso bag now. But that's those. 350 in there for a pound. Not bad. Got some band-aids. Because the back of my heel was kind of rubbing. Like my shoe. Because you know when you go on a trip you do lots and lots of walking. So... These are really, really sticky. They stayed on until I took them off. So just some standard band-aids or plasters as British people say. I got this rose body scrub, which I actually really like. I'm not really a floral sort of person, but this doesn't smell like granny-ish. It's just like a really nice rose sort of scent. And it's um, it has like these granules. It's a scrub, a body scrub, as I said. And it's actually really nice. It feels good on the skin. So that's the Rose Body Scrub. And I think that's it from Daiso. Next, let's do Etude House. <laughs> I got quite a bit. Um, okay, so I got the AC Clinic set. So I have the toner, the gel lotion, the firm cleanser. I really love this stuff. And I have the Hinoki Water Mist, which is, I think, new. I've not seen this before. I'm not sure if it's new, but yeah. I really, really like all of these. And they work so well. I had a breakout when I went to Malaysia because I was having so much orange juice. Like, it was just ugh, so delicious. And I'm very sensitive to orange juice. I always, always break out, no matter what. The next day, I'll wake up with at least one pimple. And every time I use these products the next day it had greatly reduced like the pimples so it really works it really really works i love this set so if you just wanted to get one thing i would probably say get the toner this is my favorite um product i love the cleanser and the mist as well um but yeah if i had to miss out on one thing it would probably be the gel lotion but i love all of them together um they came in a set. There was like a promotion, so just got everything. Love this um, line. Okay, let's see what else I have in this bag. I got a Missing You Very Very Cherry hand cream. I've not tried this before, and people said they're quite nice. So I'm always on the hunt for good hand cream because I don't want to have wrinkly hands. Um, some nail polishes, of course. I got three. This color is sort of like a murky blue color. I got this coral sort of ice cream one and this purple color. So three. Um, I'll put the colors below, um, the names if you're wondering. But yeah, they're really pretty. This color is really unique and um, I have this color on my toes right now. So really like these. Mm, I got another real art cleansing balm because I just love this stuff so much. It smells like lemons and it comes with a little tiny spatula like this so you can scoop out the product and it just really melts your makeup off. Um, this is what it looks like and it's just like a balm like this that turns into an oil but it doesn't feel too like some some cleansing oils that I've used before feel really uncomfortable on my face this one is really nice and i love it so much so the clinique take the day off balm and this are my favorite makeup removers at the moment for face makeup anyway and then i got some makeup things so i got this fresh cherry tint in the color hot pink so it looks like this these are really cute and really popular, but I don't think this tint lasts 
really long it just lasts for like a couple of hours but it is really really nice and i love the color so much it's very vibrant it's the exact same color um on your lips as it looks like um in the tube here even though you have even if you have pigmented lips it's still gonna work at least a bit so i like that i got this eyeshadow it's like a really nice sort of plum color my boyfriend actually picked this out and i really really like it um i don't have a single eyeshadow in this color so i'm really looking forward to trying it i got this watercolor blush in number two coral and the way that it is is just so intriguing it's like a cream blush but i don't know i've never seen this sort of thing before um what's that guy that made the watercolor blushes but yeah attitude house attitude house has them too so i really wanted to try them um i'm really interested to see what it's like like what the consistency is like i haven't tried it yet okay so i got this pencil this is a drawing show pencil in the color after blossom rd304 and it's just sort of like this plummy sort of shade it's really really pretty and i think it's meant to be used on the eyes but i'm going to use it on the lips i'm not sure it might be multi-purpose but i think the guy at the shop said that um it's for the eyes but we'll see i'm going to try it out soon it was so cool like a transgender guy was working at acted house and he was really really pretty and he was helping me so yeah oh she was helping me um i also got these tints well they're not really tints i would say they're more like matte lip creams um the packaging is to die for like oh so pretty the two colors i got are number eight um t rose and i mean sorry number seven t rose and number eight after blossom so this is the same color as the liner that i just showed you i don't know if it's a lip liner or eyeliner i'll find out soon but ugh, the box is just amazing and i'll show you what the tube looks like if you haven't seen these before so it comes like this with this foam oops this foam sort of sponge applicator i'm gonna put these on for you guys so you can see what they look like in love with these oh my god the color is gorgeous i love it this is like the perfect nude shade and what else what else I had to get masks you know when you go to active house you always get some masks <laughs> i got pomegranate lemon and green tea so just these standard sheet masks um they were really cheap i think they were on sale as well i got some mascara remover which i also use for eyeliner um it's just like a oil oil based cleanser you just shake it up and it works really well this is just some nail polish remover and i got one more tint this is the sweet recipe candy stick it's the orange one and i just love the yellow one so i decided to go for the orange this is number two the next things are all freebies that i got for purchasing stuff so the first thing is a mascara guard these are really useful if you have trouble um, like if you always get mascara on your lids depending on your eye shape sometimes it's just inevitable that you get mascara on your lids and it's really annoying um, so this helps a lot and it also helps to actually like comb out the lashes more and make them a bit longer I used to use these a lot um, but I have it for a while so I'm gonna try it again I also got this really cool brush like they gave me this for like full-sized active house brush which is so adorable and it's pink with dots and um, i don't know if you can see but i love this freebie also got a mirror which can be used as a handheld mirror or um you can fold it like this 
to yep <laughs> And the last thing is a little 2014 calendar and it comes in this little box. Oops. And it looks like this. It's really, really cute. So that's what it looks like. It's just a nice little tabletop um, calendar in the shape of a house. But well, it's kind of like the Etude House um, shops in Korea. So that is Etude House. The next thing I knew I had to pick up because so many people talk about this. This is the Hada Labo Moisturizing Lotion. And in Asia, lotion is basically toner. So it's not lotion like what we think. It's liquid. And this is meant to be extremely moisturizing. It says once sold every three seconds in Japan. So it's a huge hit product in Asia. And I love that it has English on the back. So yeah, it has hyaluronic acid in it and it's meant to um, make the skin supple and soft and um, it's really good for moisturizing the skin. So yeah, you're meant to just like pat it into the skin. Um, and you use it after you wash your face. So I'm really looking forward to trying this because so many people rave about it. I was going to get more um, products from Hada Labo, but I told myself to just calm down because I had already bought so many things for um, my skin. So if I want other things later, I can always get them online. So yeah, this is the Hada Labo Moisturizing Lotion. So many people recommended this. So if you guys are interested, check it out. I haven't even tried it yet, but so many people rave about it. I'm sure it's probably good. I got a Majolica Majorca um, mascara. I've never tried these before, but this is another hit product with lots of Asian people. Um, I got the Lash Expander Edge Meister one. I have no idea what this is, like if it's good, if it's the best one, if it's not. But I noticed that this was the only one left in its section, so I was like, okay, it must be popular. It says at the bottom, it fulfills all your wishes. So, there you go. <laughs> you gotta get it. Um, so, I don't know what the um, results will be, but decided to just give it a go. It says that you get double the length and it locks in your curl and the it's sort of like a comb it's not really like a brush i believe that's what i kind of got from the packaging but yeah majalika majorka um these are also part of my christmas present for my boyfriend this is a dolly wink liquid liner in the color black and he actually went by himself and picked up these things so he did really well i told him to just get me like some japanese stuff and he did really well this packaging is really different is this the new packaging or is it i don't know it has flowers on it instead of dots but i hope it's the same product i'm pretty sure it is just a different packaging and this is in deep black and then he got me these Dolly Wink Super Party Queen Eyelashes. These are for the bottom um, lash line, so look forward to trying those. And it has this same new packaging as well with the flower. These are some random lashes. I'm not sure what brand this is. I've never heard of this brand. But there are five pairs of lashes. I love the packaging. I love the style of the lashes. And yeah, he picked these up by himself. He, he did a really good job. They're really, really cute. And yeah, definitely looking forward to trying these items. This next product I've wanted to try for so long. This is the baby foot product. And it's basically like acid exfoliation for your feet. I suffer with extremely dry heels and dry feet. Um, so I always have to like do this sort of thing and I've used Tony Moly's which works well but I'm wondering if this is even better so I'm really really interested and it basically if you guys have never heard of these sort of products before it flakes off the dead skin cells um, the dead skin from the bottom of your feet and you put these sort of plastic socks on you leave them on for a while and you get like really really nice feet maybe like a week later um, all the skin has finished dropping off and it's really really gross 
so yeah you want to wear socks at night and stuff because the skin goes everywhere it's really messy and really disgusting if you have like a lot of dead skin on the bottom of your feet so these sorts of exfoliation like these acid exfoliators are meant to be much better for your feet compared to like um scraping them with um a foot file thingy this is meant to like penetrate rather than just like get off the first layer of dead skin um so this is meant to be much better for your skin and i'm really looking forward to trying this this is a huge hit i wanted to buy more than one but there was only one left so glad i at least got one